Let's see. Okay. Duct tape mesh in that. How do I mesh? Uh, you can find mesh in military locations or drop from mega zombies. Fuck me. Okay. Hey, how goes it? Welcome back. Um, might find what we need here. Jeez, everything's got red glowing eyes. This is not great. Now we surgically remove these problems. With a lot more experience on a night like this. Uh, let's see. Finding mesh is gonna be the hard part. Like, the real hard part. Okay, we need duct tape as well. I'm gonna get rid of this. Storage is a dream at this point. Duct tape we're taking. These gyroscope things are apparently rare and important, according to the guide I was just looking at. Mesh is what we're really looking for, because I need... Yeah, there we go. Now we can see this here, because we couldn't before. What is this? This wasn't in the thing. Before it was just fucking rubber. They made this harder? Okay, how do I make that thing? Gyroscope, a phone, a defibrillator battery, and duct tape. Oh my god. Alright, hang on. Hang on, let's just double check this. Uh, components. It's just called components, so... I'm gonna search through everything. Let's see. If I do calm, I should be able to find it. Oh my god. Alright, we have to go... Oh my god, this is going to take... No, we have to build a base. There's no way we can do this without building a base. I don't have the storage. This has become very much a long-term kind of thing now. Collect all the rubber we see. It's valuable. Kill every zombie we can at night. On this crazy fucking night. Because they are worth experience, and we need all of that. Hope we don't run into a big zombie. Vest, locale am ammo. We're actually kind of hungry, so I'm going to take this waffle and eat it. We're also thirsty, so I'm going to take this Coke and drink it. Man, they really wanted this to be a long-term goal to get down into that thing, huh? There's a pickaxe. I wonder if I can hit the, uh... a tree with a pickaxe and get anything out of it. Uh, let's see... I have an empty box on me for some reason. I gotta get rid of that. Fill this up, fill that up, fill that up. I don't have an empty box. Where is this empty box? 40 of those, that's got 40. I don't think I have an empty box on me. Still can't carry this. Get rid of that. Take this. Put it here. Okay, let's try hitting a tree with a pickaxe and see if it gets me anything. I don't think so, but maybe. The tree should fall over. I don't think I'm getting anything.
I wish I could, like, use storage that's already in the map, like, shelves and stuff in a house, and make the house my place. But I don't think that's a thing. I'm pretty sure I'll just lose it when it reloads everything. Getting a lot of the rubber we need. Not the most helpful thing right now. A compass? I don't even... I've never even had a compass. Alright, let's, um... <sighs> let's get our vehicle and get the fuck out of here, I guess. So disappointed there's not a single axe. Ugh. Uh, I have to check up the tower, don't I? Let's see. No zombies? No zombies, but also almost nothing else. Four times. What do I currently have on here? I already have it four times. Okay. Just making sure. So annoyed that I couldn't fly the fucking helicopter. This run, this run does not like me. It's fine, we'll get to this tunnel, we'll have a look around, and if there's nothing there, we're gonna go back towards the inside of the map, and see if we can find something useful. Okay, there's another one of these gyroscope things. We need that. Rubber. Duct tape. If I pick up some scrap metal, I'm completely out of, out of uh, inventory, aren't I? I wish I could just make an axe. It's a white key card. We kind of need that. Drop the nails for now. And it's raining. I don't know where these key cards go, but I know they're important. Like, necessary to the plot of the whole thing. I can't jump, so I'm just going to chill out for a second. There we go. Alright, let's figure out where we're going. Um, okay, we're all the way up here. I don't know why that's a no-build zone. Maybe we go check that out while we're up here. You know? I feel like that could be something. Or it could be death. Either one will be interesting. We need content at this point. This place kind of sucks. I'm really disappointed enough with a fucking axe. You got a good view of the whole map from up here, though. Like, on these hills. And since we're on an ATV, we don't really have to worry about much. We're kind of low on fuel. We've got a mostly full jerry can that can get us back to civilization, though. I'm expecting something fucking weird. You know, I bet that is underneath that floating island that I saw in the distance earlier. Where is it? Are we pass it? We're like directly underneath it. I bet it is too cloudy and shit for us to see. What is this? K? a downed helicopter. I don't know what a tusk is. What are we currently using? It's a very big gun. I don't think we need that, but I mean, it sounds cool. It's probably a big high cal fuck you rifle.
This feels probably compatible, right? Okay, well, there's a helicopter right here with some high-tier loot. I gotta keep that in mind. Uh, I don't know where we're going. We're just going south. We're probably gonna go back to the construction site. Fireplay, the, the fire hall. I don't know. I need an axe. I've been fucking playing around for almost two hours, my whole recording session, and I just need an axe. Okay. We'll go this way to the demolition site. Oh man. Scout that out again. We've been far enough away for long enough that it should have restocked. It should be right up this hill. And we can also do go down here real quick and have a look. I think we can't go far down here because radiation. But like, green key card and some lore. Uh, we picked a green key card which will let you open green doors uh, within these tunnels. There are more colorful doors. Correspond to more hidden areas on the map. So it's a green thing and we can open this. How poisonous is it down here? Guess we'll find out in a second if I start dying. Does this have an interior? Does not. Okay. Can I get on top of it though? I can. I feel way safer up here. Are you screaming? Oh, it's a big zombie, apparently. Did you drop anything? No. Why would I be so lucky? Entering dead zone. Alright, so we can't go down there without a respirator. That sucks. But we'll be back when we have a respirator. That's another place we can go. I wish I could drop all the keys on the ground and they would just stay there, but I'm pretty sure they'll despawn. Too tired to jump up this little ledge. There we go. Okay. We're at the point now where there's a lot of cool shit everywhere, and if I just had a... Uh an axe. We could play the whole game. I'm seeing so many sledgehammers. There's like a million fucking sledgehammers around here. Keep looking at that thing and thinking I can use it, but I can't. Okay. At least this place is reset. Shovel, son of a bitch. Small generator. Man, I wish I could carry that out. I mean, I could drop, like, the parachute. Generator is probably more important than a parachute, and I know where I can probably get one by the uh, helicopter, so... More duct tape. More rubber. So many sledgehammers that are totally useless to me. I'm pretty sure I can't get a, cut down a tree with a sledgehammer. Although maybe I can turn a sledgehammer into an axe. Is that an option? I haven't tried. Let's 
drop this for a second. Come on. Come on. Crafting. Uh, this. I can scrap it. Oh, uh, nope. I don't know how many slots that pack is, but it's probably not that good. Probably a useless thing to do. Cloth seeds. That doesn't help me. Alright, well. Drop that on the ground. I guess I'll keep carrying this for now. At least I can set that down out where I want to build my base and it shouldn't despawn. This is the third time we've been here during this recording session. Hammers and sledgehammers everywhere. More sledgehammers. A piece of a roof tile. I could build that somewhere and it would be a thing on the ground. Another saw, which doesn't help me. The ammo I dropped here earlier? Maybe I can just drop some shit on the ground. I'm surprised it didn't go away. Maybe I haven't hit, like, the items on the ground limit yet or something. Golf club, of course. Alright, let's check upstairs. Man, this is painful. I just want to find an axe. If I find... I've, I have found an axe before, and then we died and lost it. But if I find an axe, we can do all the stuff that I wanted to do all episode. The hammer. The hammer. Can I take a metal bar and make an axe out of it? No. I don't know. Metal bars everywhere. Somehow that doesn't help me at all. Another shovel. More generators. Another hat. Rubber and stuff. Alright, well, fuck me. Um, another totally useless episode. One of these days, we're going to find something. Just not today, apparently. Um, and where the fuck am I going next? Fire station again? I just keep going in loops. There's only a couple places it could be. There's a shovel right on the ground there. That's not what I need. Can I go down in there? Wait, it spun me around. Where am I? Nails and metal and sticks. And nothing useful. Yep, totally useless. Alright, well, I'm gonna starve to death. Uh, I guess next time we're going to just keep doing the cycle until we find what we need. Fuck. Hey, how goes it? Welcome back to Hand of Fate. Let's just get right into this. The more I wonder. What do you wonder, dealer? 
He's not going to tell me. Alright, what are we going up against now? The Jack of Scales, that's right, we got lizard people coming. This will be fun. We have Mana Drain, so we have worse cooldowns. Last man standing um, in every combat, uh, the last enemy alive is no longer stun interrupted. That's fine. The suit of scales are represented by these lizard men. Mm -hmm. Quiet, patient, lethally subtle, and coldly intelligent. Of all the creatures I have incarnated as suits, these please me the most. They are pretty cool. I'm interested to see them like in combat. 